my beautiful people. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful Monday, the day before Christmas Eve. Woohoo! <laughs> I just got off of work not too long ago and I'm already in my pajamas. Nice and clean, washed and dried. And I just love these pajamas. And I got another pair of pajama pants, but I got a white t-shirt from the Dollar Tree to wear with that set. So, I'm set for a while. But anywho, I needed to pick up a few things to um, complete my cooking. Because last night I did a lot of baking, and I'm going to show you guys that in another video. But um, I still have to make a pecan pie and an apple pie, but... We'll see. I might save those for the new year. I don't know. But anyway, I got up from work. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. And I did a Aldi's run. Hold on for a minute. I want to show you guys something. I'll be right back. Okay, my beautiful people. Sorry about that. All right. So I went to Aldi's to pick up a few things. I got these coupons. I'm going to turn the camera around so you guys can see. I got these coupons um, a couple of weeks ago. Where you can get five dollars off every week for the last three weeks you can get five dollars off a 30 30 dollar minimum purchase so i did not purposely i purposely did not use the first two because i didn't need them because i had already done my grocery shopping at walmart but this last week i said let me go and pick up stuff that i know are really nicely priced i'm almost out of the eggs that i bought for 49 cents and when i checked tonight they were back up to a dollar nine cents so <laughs> i was like dang but they only let you get three anyway so anywho this is my little aldi's haul and i got me finally got me a pack of chicken wings i should have got two but I don't know what I was thinking, but I'm still tasting those lemon pepper chicken wings. And oh my God, I can't wait to make them. I bought some icing and just in case I make my, um, my gingerbread cookies, I was going to make this because, you know, the making your own icing is very easy as well. But they had this at all these and I just, I don't know how much it was. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Where's the icing? Oh, it was only two sixty nine. So I got that. This is my dinner for tonight because I'm not cooking anything. I'm getting ready to pop this French bread, French bread pizza, Mama Cozy's. This is all these um, label. And the last big one I had was really, really good. But I'm telling y'all, when I was pregnant with my son, y'all, I ate so much of these French bread pizzas. It's a wonder if my son doesn't hate pizza, but instead he loves pizza. <laughs> I ate so many of these things when I was pregnant. When I didn't want nothing else, I would pop, uh, you know, these in the oven and eat these French bread pizzas. And I love them, so... I have a head of cabbage in the refrigerator that I got from the pantry and I'm going to combine that together with this head of cabbage that I got from Aldi's. Never heard of this. Birch Farms Cabbage. Got to be North Carolina. So I got that. I get tired of going and picking up one onion here and one onion there. So I just got a whole pack of onions and I don't even know what I paid for those onions. Let me see. The idea was to go in and spend oh, $1.49 for those. The idea was to go in and spend a minimum of $30 so you could get $5 off. So it's kind of like the family dollar in the Dollar Tree, you know, spend $30 and get $5 off and you actually get it for $25. But I went over, I spent $43.57, no, I spent $47.07 minus my $5, it brought it down to $42.07 plus the tax brought it back up to $43.57. But... There's a specific reason for that. They had the Honeycrisp apples, and they were big. I mean, really big. I'm going to have to split those in threes. And they ended up being uh, $1.45. And then I got some blackberries, which I don't know if these are too are good or not. Um, Y'all know how I like my blackberries, but I spent $3.49 on these. I thought they said they were on sale, but I guess not. Anyway, I got that. I got some low-sodium chicken broth to make my stuffing with. I forgot 
my ground sausage. I knew I was forgetting something. Daggone it. I like to put ground sausage in my stuffing. And so I'm going to have to go back and get that. And I got, I got thirsty while I was in there. Because like I said, I had just gotten off from work. So I got me some black tea. Unsweetened. Aren't y'all proud of me? It tastes like bleh. <laughs> Then I saw this caramel. This is their brand, Friendly Farms Almond Milk Creamer. And y'all know I love me some almond milk. I can drink it. It doesn't bother my tum-tum. And it only has 6 grams of carbohydrates and 5 grams of sugar per 1 tablespoon. So I was like, ooh, I'm going to try that because y'all know how I love my caramel. But this is what really, really brought my price up. I saw these slippers. Okay, and I've been looking for some nice slippers, and these are the Sierra Loungewear, Sierra Loungewear Ladies Memory Foam Slippers, and they were $6.99, and I got that pattern right there. I got them on my feet right now, trying to break them in. Y'all can see them. Woo-hoo-hoo, woo hoo hoo <laughs> So, and then I saw this waffle maker on Beth's frugal mama in the woods and her and Carmen were using it for the first time and I thought I heard she said she I thought I heard her say she got it from um Aldi's and when I went in there their boxes were all banged up this was the best box out of what was left they only had two left and it's the I don't know what that says Am Ambiano I'm trying to see what that says it's the Ambiano four slice waffle maker and it was $9.99 and I was like, oh my God, I can't pass that up. Even if they had any left after Christmas, I'm sure they would break, you know, lower it and they would fly out and they only had two. So I thought $10 for this was really, really good. So again, another gadget, but again, I will be putting it down underneath my cabinet until I need it. <laughs> but I'm so happy to have a waffle maker so I can make me some waffles. And um, Beth, I think, made chicken and waffle sliders. Oh, it looks so good. Y'all go over and check out Beth on Frugal Mama in the Woods and her daughter Carmen, my niece Pooh. They are awesome. And, and Carmen has a channel of her own, Broke um, Budget Fashionista. Y'all go say hi and tell them Sadie sent you. And then I still had, every time I turn around, y'all, I have a few more people to send Christmas cards. Next year, I'm going to get three boxes, okay? I thought I had three, three Christmas cards in here, but I guess I only had two. But I have three more people I got to send them to. It might have fallen out in the car. But I got this one. It's so cute. It says Merry Christmas. Santa and his reindeer carrying the, the things. And it says, Hope Santa brings all your favorite things. <laughs> and then this one says Merry Christmas with the reindeer and the raccoon. And I guess that's a kitty cat or a rabbit up top and the bird. And I thought that was so cute. Anything that says Merry Christmas really, really is what I'd be looking for. It's got the little gifts in the corner. And this one says, um, let me see if I can read that. Let's see. Hope you have a warm and cozy Christmas. So that was my Aldi's haul. And like I said, the, the objective was to spend $30 to get $5 off. But I did go over a little bit. I probably could have stayed in, in price range if I hadn't bought those slippers. But I couldn't resist. Then I went over to Walmart's to do a water run because I like, you know, I won't go anywhere near Walmart's during the day. So I went in there like quarter to nine and I got a couple of jugs of water and this was all the tonic water they had. But I'll, I'll take that from right now. And y'all know there's a Dollar Tree right there by the Walmart. So I had to run in there real quick. I wanted some chocolate mint ice cream, but they didn't have it. So I got this butter pecan and they kill me, crack me up saying real ice cream. So I got the butter pecan because I just got a hankering for some ice cream. And I found a couple of new magnets in there. This one says never stop dreaming. That's cute. Y'all know me and my magnets. This one says thankful, grateful, and blessed. And this one is cute. She just shines. So it's like a diamond. She just shines. So that was really cute. 
I am truly running out of room on my refrigerator with my magnets, but y'all know I make room, I'll find room. But I hope you guys enjoy watching <laughs> my little small collective haul. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. I hope everyone enjoys their holiday. Have a very, very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And I pray, I pray that we all will. <sighs> have a blessed year coming i guess that's what i want to say i don't know i kind of had a brain fart for a minute but anyway love peace and happiness sweet sadie j coming back at you remember guys be kind to each other the world is big enough for us all please like comment and subscribe and y'all have a blessed blessed day bye